Alrighty then. We're going to get back to the wolf among us. And see what's happening in this in this next episode. Then uh, we didn't we didn't do too well. By the way, I wanted to ask. What do you think? It's been like 110 degrees here, so I figure I'm, I'm living in heck. I might as well look like I belong there, huh? What do you think? And by the way, this is just a side note. This is just a side note because I just have to. Any of you guys got one of these stupid iPhones? I have one. I hate it. I don't use it. It's a work thing. Mine's, I've got a really nice phone. I actually have a real phone, one that is functional. This thing is a piece of crap. Sorry for all you iPhone users. <clears throat> I'm sorry you actually use iPhones. But I just wanted to show you this because this is so cute. Are you ready? No, that's not that. Which button do you put? Where's Siri? Come on, Siri. Come up here, honey. There we go. Siri. Up, up, hold okay. on. Siri, what is zero divided by zero? Imagine that you have zero cookies and you split them evenly among zero friends. How many cookies does each person get? See, it doesn't make sense. And Cookie Monster is sad that there are no cookies, and you are sad that you have no friends. <laughs> Tell me that ain't awesome. Cookie Monster is sad that there's no cookies, and you're sad because you have no friends. <laughs> That actually said that. I didn't make it. it that's just what it do it on yours. All right. Well, <laughs> enough of that. Let's let's get into the game, shall we? This is just too good. I couldn't resist. I had to share that with y'all. It was awesome. Ah. Uh, I did as well as I could to take out the buckshot, but there's still some shards left embedded in your shoulder. They'll eventually warm their way out on their own, but until they do, you're gonna be sore. Big B, Dr. Swinehart was appointed Fabletown physician for a reason. It's okay. There's only one thing you have to take away from all this. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Don't go looking for any more fights. Keep strain off your heart. And try and get some rest. How's everyone else? They all make it? They're fine. Oh, good. I had everyone that got wounded sent home. Holly refused to let me see where she lived. So I left her and Grendel back at her bar with a dose of juniper and spring water. The Titans, Bigby. They'll South be fine. Southern. Just remember what I said. The stitches won't hold up if you continue to act like you normally do. Yeah. Everything in moderation. Thanks. And uh, eat more chicken. Your blood pressure's through the proverbial roof. Chicken. I'll try to. All right then. Very good. All right then. Oh, it's a hello phone. I bet Business you nobody office. has ever actually seen a phone. That I looks know. Like that I'll have to call you back. I have, because that's what they the look like. The town is starting to find out. Well, I'll leave you two to it then. Miss White, Big B. Big stock. Appreciate it. Put a shirt on. Cover that nastiness up. You're just trying to look sexy for snow. I know what you're doing. I'm too sexy for my love. Too sexy for my love. Love's going to leave me. I know what you're doing. So, to recap... Crane watched me through the magic mirror, uncover his room at the open arms, and then he smashed it so we couldn't use it ourselves to go after him. And we know this because Buffkin was drinking in the rafters. Yeah. That about cover it? And once he puts all Good the pieces job, back together, it'll be easy to catch Crane. So, uh -huh. I guess that's the plan, currently. But I, I don't know. We just wait for the mirror now. Hey, I hit the button. What the hell is going on? Just, I don't know what the Tweedles get out of this. I don't know if Crane sent them. I don't know if, I mean, this is gonna sound crazy. What if I don't know? Do you but, really you know. think Crane did it? Everything points to him, I get it, but do you really think he killed those women? Because it's just- I'm, just I'm as confused sure. as you are, to be honest. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense. He's... 
He was a conniver. A, yes. A coward. Yes. A liar. Yes. And I'll always hate him for that. And I'll hate him for how he held it, me in his thoughts. But murdering gonna be really prostitutes. Creepy feeling. Ow. Everything okay over there? Careful, buff kid. Yes, Miss White. I just cut myself on a piece of the glass. Nothing to worry about. Thanks for tonight, by the way. No, you're welcome. That could have gone really terribly. I mean, even worse than it did. I'm glad you were there. I just feel bad for Holly, really. Yeah. And you. And you. That didn't come eventually. out well, did it? That didn't come At out. least, I hope so. For her sake. Yes, well. Mm. Can I, um, ask you a question? Yes. It's kind of personal. Actually, and if you really I don't want it, to offend um, you, but after tonight, it's on my mind. Why? What's on your mind? What's love got to do? Got to do with it? What's love but a second-hand emotion? It's just when stuff hits the fan, like stuff. like it did tonight. Stuff. It feels like before we came to the city. It feels kind of like home. And I've heard it said that maybe in some tiny little bottled up way deep inside, you kind of enjoy it when things go wrong. Because okay, it gives you an excuse to, to just, you know, stop pretending. Fuck no, I don't enjoy it. Are you kidding me? It's horrible what happened tonight. I wish it didn't happen. Yeah. I shouldn't have said anything. You shouldn't have, because that was mean. That was a mean thing to say. Uh, guys? Houston, we have a problem. Yes. We have a problem. What is it? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Of course we are. What do you mean, missing a piece? Yes, it's, uh... It's not here. Crane must have taken a shard with him. Oh, I can't believe this. Why is there a I saw Crane pick something up after he smashed it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize what it was until now. The mirror well, can't drunk, work so. unless it's whole. Well, that's not entirely true. Or what, Buffkin? What? We what? sit around and wait until it mends itself? We have no idea how long that will take. We're just gonna <sighs> have to do this the hard way. I'm just saying, waiting is an option. No. We can't depend on the mirror. All right. How long will it take for the mirror to reform? Well, it could take days. Or months, or years. He had to have left something that tells us where he's going. He's a neat freak, but he was never that smart. Smart enough to take a piece of the mirror. Yes. We can still solve this ourselves. I know Never that mind it... that. Come help me look. Look for what? I'm getting tired of being her lapdog, by the way. I'm just saying, because that's just... That's getting tiresome. And you know that's what she's doing. She's treating him like a lapdog. Well, let's look at all the things. Normal stuff. Inbox, there's a key, room 207. What is it? It's the key to his room at the open arms. Perv. You still haven't told me what was in there. A dead body, I all cut up. I know. Crane was, uh, paying Lily to live out a fantasy him and you together yeah forgive me if I spare you the details that is just creepy come on I keep thinking back I keep replaying moments in my head interactions with him when he'd catch me in the elevator or bump into me outside <sighs> there's only so much you can repress you know yeah. I don't know about that uh well you couldn't have known no you couldn't have known. No, I don't I know why I'm being nice to her. Come she's on, being let's mean keep to me. Being really mean to me, and I don't like it. Uh, letter, letter, letter. Little boy Blow. <laughs> At least provide us with a fan. Oh, you should have seen it when the air conditioner broke here. Oh my god, it was horrible. It was 102 degrees in here. 102 degrees inside. 
puppy was not happy. Yeah, Mr. Toad says, get your shot together. Did Crane ever do any work? Only when Cole not was really. around. So that was his thing then, huh? Just to uh, sit around there and fantasize about snow. Sounds kinky. Open the damn thing up. Okay, that's got to be fun. I hit... Come on. Where's the damn thing at? Come on. Go. Oh. Pushed the wrong button. The buttons are so confusing. There's a page here that was torn out. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? The king of... It's a ring, at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone <laughs> in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going to see. Wait, what? What witch? Wait, what, what, what meeting? Well, he what, called wait, up what? somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that is. Well, yes, it sounded like or the one he got his, is. uh, you glamours from. I'm sure it's about this ring. <laughs> you must have it. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. Buffkin! And I'm hungover. I'm sorry. Yeah, well, that they happens. set the meeting at 2 a.m. Tonight. Ooh. What's going on? Tonight. Is the mirror oh, fixed the yet? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the mirror fixed or isn't it? You called I me. I called to... just to see if you knew where Crane could be, and that was it, okay? And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. The cat's out of the bag. So, uh, can yeah. we find the dull pervert or not? Just I tried to get, get the hell out of here. This is none of your business. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. <coughs> and now it's none of my business? We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, yeah. please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't the time. He took a piece of the mirror so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. Don't tell him. A.M. or P.M.? Uh, A.M. Listen, Blue, Thanks. you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in any position to turn away help. Define help. What do you know about Crane, anyway? That he has the stones to kill prostitutes like any common sex-frightened serial killer and not face a real challenge. Look, we know that Crane is well. going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. I recognize that voice. The Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And is none that of Lee? you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? Comment down Nobody, below. Who else agrees with these? That's me. Money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years. I'm heading up the investigation, okay, Bluebeard? That makes this a moot point. And somebody needs to run the business office while he does so. Well then, excuse me for having the Commonwealth in mind. Tell me that's not Lee's voice. That's Lee. All right, let's the just Dead. Come look on, on come the on. bright side. We know Tell Crane me that's is not going Lee. to see the witch that's been supplying him black market glamours. Thanks to me. And that he'll be there at two. So that gives us two hours. A few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all at once. And a few shorter hours, the more you babble about it. We haven't been the ones babbling. Yeah, yeah. Just point in the direction you want me to check first. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. And I don't huh. think Holly's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address or a phone number or something. And Bigby is free to go idea. there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking is just what do the two Tweedles know about this? That's it doesn't a matter what they know. After tonight, they'd never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The Trip Trap is the better option to track the witch down. That has to be our focus. Look, chances are I'll have to swing by both anyways. No, so. chances are you won't have time. I don't really God. care what to do. She's I'm such going a to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the you? key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then I'll pick the blasted lock. <sighs> I've wasted enough time the mirror to find him. I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? 
I've no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. What concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, you need and now to stay it's a crime scene. Bluebeard, just stay out of it, all right? You'll just mess things up further. They can't get any more messed up. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere. And is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of couch cushions. Look, this is how a smart person would do it. Really? So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. Uh, where do I want to go? I don't go? know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. Where are you going to go, Bigby? Uh, let's go talk to Holly. We need to find the witch. Witch, witch, the wicked witch. So you leave Crane alone, and we'll leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. Oh my, decisions, decisions, because whichever one I choose is going to be the wrong one, you know that. Let's go talk to Holly. Huh? That's actually probably the best. The witch's ever. identity must be with Lily's stuff. I should go see Holly first. Perfect. Yeah. And I'll go to Crane's apartment. I'll check in with you later. So where in the hell are you going? I hope you know what you're doing. I never know what I'm doing. Well. Alrighty then. You know what that means? That means... Pause! <laughs> so. We're going to stop there for a little bit. That'll be the end of this episode. We'll go and we'll check out Holly and her things and, and all that other good stuff in just a minute. And uh, we'll pick that up in the next episode. How's that sound? Does that sound like a plan? Sound like a plan to me. In the meantime, go get yourselves your iPhones and, and <laughs> prove me wrong. Also, put in the comments, by the way, was that not... No, I don't. I didn't bother to read any credits because yeah, I, I don't do that until... Well, I haven't gotten to the end of this game yet. So, well, I guess I did it one time. Anyhow, tell me that's not Lee, uh, Lee's voice from the, uh, the Walking Dead. Put it in the comments down there. Don't forget to check out the, the Twitter feed. You can click here and it'll just take her right in there to that. Uh, check out the Facebook page. You can, I think you can click right in here somewhere and down in there someplace. And it'll take you into that. And, and or there or up there or over there or around around there I don't know <laughs> till the next time you folks have a fantastic one and I will see you in the next episode alrighty cool beans alrighty bye 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 bye